Hi, my name is Lawal McCray Sr. I'm the head football coach at Blanche Ely High School. We're located in Pompano Beach, Florida. According to many different sources, football was first played at different time frames in our history. The man that is known as the father of American football is Mr. Walter Camp. Coach Camp actually formed the rules that we have now in place, are the foundation of the rules we have now in place in the NFL. Rules such as the number of players allowed on each side of the ball, the alignment of players was formed by him. The game was generally came from the game called rugby. And it's said that the first game was played between teams from Scotland and England on Canadian soil. But once again, the history varies on that. But one thing we do know in 1892 was when Walter Kemp changed the rules of the football. In addition to some of the rules, along with the number of players allowed and the alignment, was also the rule of the forward pass. The rule of forward pass stated that when the quarterback throws the, throws the football, it must be past the line of scrimmage or in front of the quarterback. Those are three of the many rules that, was in, that changed with the game of football. Also, equipment. In rugby, there wasn't an equipment. And Walter Camp decided we needed to work. The game was so physical that pads should be used. Thus started the thigh pads and shoulder pads and knee pads. Also, the helmet. At that time, it was a leather helmet. As time moved on, you know, now we have the modern day helmet. But it all started with a guy we call the father of American football, Coach Walter Camp. I believe football is going on so long and it's loved by so many of the world because of competitive nature. The game is so competitive that guys go and bang their bodies into each other to achieve a certain goal. And that's the foundation of what American pride is about. Achieving our goals, working hard, and being competitive. 